Where's my money? Where, where, is, where the hell's my money? Oh, fuck, we're rolling. <laughs> hey, everybody, my name's Freezing Inferno, and welcome to Let's Play Adventure Island 4. We'll be taking a wonderful tour of uh, World 2, the Volcano World, so keep your hands and arms inside the vehicle at all times. And let's get rolling. And you'll notice this giant rock here is gone, so we can head on in through this little passage and get to World the Second Volcano. Grab some fruit, get some spiders. So I'll do the Volcano World entrance is down here. There's some sort of big rock up there that can't be moved yet, but you want to go to the right or left. Left. I am a master of directions. We are in a dinosaur park, and entering the spade door reveals Red Taylor, also more lovingly known as Muffin! He was rescued at the end of World 1, and now we can use him whenever we want by coming here. Red Taylor Muffin here can shoot fire and go through the lava, which is a very helpful skill. Now these little sprouts here are rubber tree plants that you can bounce on like little springboards. You see, good old Red Taylor can... <laughs> Go around in the lava. A skill will be very helpful down here. Now, you notice these wilted plants. Well, gee, boss, what do we got to do for those? Also, this cave is dark. If you have your torch, you can light it up. But we've got Red Taylor, who has magical fire breath. So, we enter this door and... Oh, my God, giant snake. It's a mini boss. Very easy mini boss with Red Taylor, because you just shoot him for, like, 15 seconds and he dies. E easy as that. He drops down an item, the water gun, which will be used to no end in these volcano segments. So we just grab some more stuff. And one of the water gun's functions is bringing life to these wonderful little sprouts so you can uh, bounce on them. We'll just get rid of this thing. Is that a Queen Elizabeth II mole, small thing? I don't, I, I don't, I'm not quite sure. Anyway, we bounce up here. Switch back to my bones, because I want to kill that bat. Now, in here is a very, very valuable treasure. But getting it is hard. Yeah. It's a very tricky jump to make. So, I will be right back when I make that jump and get that wonderful egg. See you soon. Oh, would you look at that? I made it. Okay. It's a heart container. That's what it was. Another wonderful little heart on your life bar. So, back to water gun. Back to bones, so we can get rid of you, Mr. Small Queen Elizabeth II. I don't even know what the hell you are. I don't even know why I bother switching to Red Taylor like that, because you still have to keep doing this. Now here's another of the Water Gun secondary features. You see these wonderful little bridges on fire? You can put them out, but... the hell with that. Red Taylor time. Ah, the old Red Taylor blocking those wonderful, wonderful, wonderful... blocky rocks away. Now up there is the uh, correct way to go, but over here there's a little extra something in case you need it. You know, just in case. A little heart. A little extra life. Back to old red. As we move across the lava, watch out for that uh, little thing. And brighten up. Crazy little bouncy sprouts day. Ah, this one is lovely. This section is sort of like the uh, volcano levels from Adventure Island the Third. Whoa! Hey, no, no, don't, don't kill my red tailor. I'm not leaving without my red tailor. No. All right, this guy just shoots fire. We'll just deal with him like that. Now this red tailor, not this red tailor, the snake down there is pretty dangerous. Got another one of those guys, and I had to switch back because there's another little alternate way you can go that I will completely show off for you today. You want to take these wonderful war prizes. You take either the second or the third. Don't take the first because it'll just lead you up over this armadillo. And we 
get a water gun, sprout up here, and that's a heart. Just a regular heart, in case you're low on health, which I'm doing okay on health, actually. Okay, back up the warp pipe we go. Switch to my bones so I can deal with the uh, smole up there. Ah, smole. Alright, back to you, Muffin, Red the Tailor. Whoa, that was pretty close. Just keep rolling along the dead wilderness. Ah! Another alternate path with a lovely treasure. Now you can pick up those blocks and throw them on the lava if you don't have Red Tailor, but if you do have Red Tailor, just walk over here and get this meat in case you're low on health. They're giving you lots of health. You gotta give them credit for that. You're not... Oh, hey! Invincibility! How amazing is that? So we just totally tanked through that part. We would probably need to use a... You know... The uh, water gun on. And we are at the boss. Which we will switch to the uh, bones for. Alright. This thing is a giant fire orb. And contrary to popular belief, you don't want to use your water gun on this, even though it's a uh, frickin' fire boss, because it'll just take forever, because you can only shoot one bubble at a time with your water gun, whereas you can shoot multiple bones at a time and just completely wreck this thing's shit. Hey, he's dead! Except he's not, he's split into two. And what he does here is he shoots his top half at the top and the bottom half at the bottom. Nothing a little careful dodging can't handle. It does that little rotation and comes around again. You kill one half and, well, you're pretty safe. But he's still not dead. He splits into four. This guy is persistent. Oh, damn. Yeah, you gotta be quick about that or else you're gonna get hit by his rotations. There we go. They go down fairly quick. Bingo! We have beaten the volcano level. And now a taste of what to come is next after the uh, volcano dries out and is a uh, burnt out magma husk. Hey, it's Blue Taylor! You saved him. I don't know why they gave you the better dinosaur first, but he's happy. And he gives us the snowboard. You remember the skateboard from Adventure Island? Well, the snowboard's kind of like that. And they'll give you this little tutorial to show you that you can just jump up here and snowboard your way back here. And we're back home somehow. Let's 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 go take a nap, hey? All right, that's our password for the uh, next fellow to uh, take this on. And who might that be, you ask? I think it's time to announce who our next contestant is. So give me another transition, if you please. Well, there's only one unsolved mystery left. Now that the volcano world has been vanquished, who am I going to pick to do the next world of this Adventure Island 4 LP? Well, the winner who gets the dubious honor of taking on the ice world is a very lucky person <laughs> to have to deal with frozen tundras and ice physics, I'll tell you that much. Hoo <laughs> boy. Alright. Jirum roll, please. And the winner who gets to take on the ice world is none other than Rainiac! Follow the annotation on this channel. The next video in the Adventure on the 4LP will be hosted there. It's been fun, guys. Catch you later.